Idaho Lorax. Okay, welcome. I'm Idaho Lorax, General Delivery, Pocatello, Idaho. Uh, I guess I had 17 items last time while violating my livelihood, my rights um, regarding Brian's banishment of me. So I have to inform you, at least I've been on uh, at least six parks because I am an active neighborhood watch member of many of these neighborhoods. Of course, they're all centered around public park here. So I want to let you know, uh, police are here. They want to arrest me. I'm saying, hey, arrest me. I want to face my accusers, Brian and anybody else. Uh, in that same regard, I was even told today that the police were looking into another trespass on me. And uh, hey, I'm waiting. They can want me to met with the executive's office over the particular facilities agency in the town. Uh, no police showed up. Well, I'm still trying to get arrested in this town and face my accusers. Are you my accusers? Well, let's see. I apparently know. So, in that regard, and of course my health concern is, why am I banned from public access television? So it's public access, isn't it? Free speech, right? Why am I part of that ban, Brian? And I'm going to give you, out of my heart, 30 seconds of my free speech time for you to just, here, you got your legal assistants right next to you. Tell me why I am banned from Public Television 12, especially Idaho Lorax Speaks program, or the Living with Uranium, for the protection of Idaho and Pocatello citizens, children, you know, residents. Here, Ruth, please, give them 30 seconds. There, Ruth, you know, 30 seconds, please. Brian, respond. Why am I banned from Channel 12? Not believe in free speech? Tongue tied? Well, anybody want to help them? Steve, you're smiling there. I've got a big smile on my face. <laughs> <laughs> that uh, silence was beautiful. Uh, yes. Amen. You know, I'm a person who fills in dead space, but I'd love just to hear it, Brian. I think a lot of people in the community would like to hear it. Well, in that regards, in terms of free speech, public access, frights of assembly, harassment against my person, either in the allegations of uh, reasons for trespass, I quicker I can get you thrown out of office and put in jail, happier I'll be, and I think a lot of other people in this community. So who's up for re-election next, next year? Steve, oh, okay, good. I do need you. Didn't want you to miss that. Out, <laughs> okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome.